Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you may be watching. This is Talk Tonight. I'm your host, Dan Smith. It's been a rough bank holiday weekend, but life goes on. And this morning I've been treated to something that I've been looking forward to for a long, 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 long time. Brand new Arctic Monkeys. There'd better be a mirror ball. So I woke up. Mixed reviews on socials. Um, it obviously, I mean, I've seen mixed reviews about their setup, reading on leads, people complaining that they weren't very, they weren't interacting much or they're slowing it down. And this song sort of represents that change in tempo. It's very loungy. I think the use of strings is phenomenal. It's, it just, it hits you. When you put Alex Turner in a project where strings are involved very much like the Last Year Puppets, he always strikes gold. And this song's very much a grower. Not in the fact that you're going to have to listen to it over and over again for it to grow on you. It, maybe some of you will, but for, it grows as the song goes on. You know, it starts out with the, uh, I think it's like 40, 50 second instrumental before just dropping and then it sort of builds in. And this is a direct follow on from Tranquility Bass. And it's sort of, you know, the journey back from all that space. Um, yeah, all, all the aliens and the, the hotel on the moon and how he's transitioning back into air into reality and it's, it's a love song at the end of the day that's my take on it and if we think back to the early early works of Arctic Monkeys as everyone loves to do and and you see the um the blend of lyricism you've gone from in whatever people say um, lyrics such as oh I might wear classic Reeboks or knackered Converse when you've also got songs such as Fake Tales of San Francisco you know she talks of San Francisco she's from Hunter's Bar and they're great songs and now you're listening to this and you've got Alex Turner poetically wailing about you better walk me back to my car and it just shows that sort of the the maturity and they're never going to go back to that but he, he writes as is as he is you know he's not in that era anymore he has gone from the clubs to now walking back from the bar with the mirror ball I enjoyed it like I said, the the song does grow and grow as it goes on. And like I said, the use of strings throughout is superb. I'm very, very impressed by the drums in this as well, by the way. Obviously, we all know Matt Held is one of the best drums in the world. But his variation in tempo and the way he can just control any song, you know, unbelievable. So, yeah. New Arctic Monkeys song, like I said, has been mixed reviews. For me, I enjoyed it. I don't think it's groundbreaking. I don't think it's the best song they'll ever release. It's good. But, you know, that's just what we've come to expect. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. Drop us a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Take care.